Start counting from 1 and end at 9. This sequence of numbers, which you have been taught to remember since you were in daycare, can actually become something so beautiful. Don't believe me? Well, let's see. Today, we are going to be dealing with consecutive numbers. For example, 1, 2, 3 are consecutive numbers. 199, 200, 201 are also consecutive numbers. But 342, 498, and 24 are not consecutive numbers. Why? Well, the word consecutive comes from Latin origin. It means following closely, which makes sense because consecutive essentially refers to the successive or ordered sequence of numbers. You order the numbers from smallest to largest. The clearest example being the number line you are so familiar with. Well, today we are going to be making spiral laterals using the idea of consecutive numbers. For this project, you will need a piece of graph paper or dotted paper and some colorful markers. For the first try, let's focus on the numbers 1 through 9. We're going to draw a line one unit long and then turn our marker to the right and draw another line as long as the next number, which in our case is 2. We will continue on until we have reached 9. Remember, always change directions between each number, otherwise the pattern will not work. Once you have reached 9, repeat the pattern again, making sure to turn right every time you finish drawing the segment. You can also change your marker color or even experiment with other types of paper. Once you're finished, it should look something like this. Now that you've gotten the hang of it, you can also experiment with other sequences. You can go backwards, such as 4, 3, 2, 1, or even focus on a certain part of the sequence, such as 6, 7, 8. You can also try it with multiplication tables, such as with your twos. The sequence would be 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and so on. However, if you want to do the multiplication tables, make sure the number is not too large to fit on the page. Just have fun and experiment with all the sequences. Now do you believe me? Isn't it interesting how even the most basic of math can become art? And it was so easy too. The idea of consecutive numbers is so important in many mathematical operations. Especially seen in statistics, you have to order your numbers in consecutive order to determine the median, range, and so much more. And these important values that you solve can be used in everyday problems. That's why you learn them at such a young age. Well, I hope you had a lot of fun making spiral laterals with me. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye!